think you're so sexy. Sexy. Tom, mate, when did the most attractive man in the world start working here? Follow-up question, do you reckon he's the sort to begrudge an extra saveloy with his order, if you know what I mean? I'm sorry, Olivia. No. OK, as of today, I must officially request that you no longer bang the newbies. We're short-staffed as it is... And oh, the big man, yeah? Big shiny new badge. Don't try and act like a boss all of a sudden. I saw you wee yourself when we were ten. Give him two weeks before he realises you're vastly underqualified to be our supervisor anyway. Well, yeah, but that's two weeks of zero confrontation until I have to start raising my voice, isn't it? Which you know gives me nosebleeds, so... Lives! Oi! Work! <clears throat> did you get my event invite for tomorrow? For Nan's funeral? I did, as it goes. Do you not reckon it was slightly weird to do that on Facebook? Why didn't you respond? Because I don't know if I can make it, Tom. Well, then click maybe. <laughs> well, you've embarrassed yourself there, mate, so don't give you that option anymore, right? It's either yes, no, or interested. And I'm not being funny, that sounds like a slightly inappropriate response to a funeral invitation, did not it? She died in the bath, you say? I'm interested. Tell me more. Well, first of all, you're not invited to the funeral, you're invited to the wake. Don't want you bursting into flames in the church. Secondly, the wake's back at mine, so, you know, wants to stop you popping in and have a little bit of sad quiche. Right. Don't be weird. But your dog does not respect my transgender situation. Liv, he jumps up on everyone, I've told you That this. is a lie. Tom, he jumps up on boys, yeah? He tries to get his leg over with the ladies. I walk in, it's mano a mano as far as he's concerned. He's on me like a furry scrum half. Are, are you seriously telling me my dog is conscientiously objecting to your life choice? I'm saying you've got yourself a Daily Mail dog, yeah. Look, I told you, all you've got to do is just pin him down and assert who the alpha is, like that. Alpha, my anus. You look like somebody pulled Macaulay Culkin out of a skip. Look, please, just come for about an hour. I'll come over again once you've taught your pets it's 2019. Just admit it. The reason you don't like funerals is because, despite looking like a cadaver, you don't like not being the centre of attention. Back, back, oh, he's on the move. Lives. And hot new guy just went into the ladies. What the fuck? No, no, no. The gender neutral toilets had them installed last week. Brilliant. What else are going to take away from me? If I'd wanted to shit next to a man, I would have kept my big transgender mouth shut. Whose idea were they? That'd be bloody Vivian and beefy Linda. Yeah. Passive, aggressive twat flaps. They would rather go carte blanche on the bog situation and make everyone use the same toilet than share the ladies with me and have to admit that I'm a woman. What do they think I'm going to do in there? Spray everywhere like a cat and claim it for the transgender community? <laughs> nice handbag, Viv. I'm having that. Yeah? Tampon machine. Don't even need it. Yeah? Sad children's charity poster. Tss, ding, ding, ding. I'm not sure that'd be the best advert for trans people. You pissing all over the faces of sad children. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. I'm not using them. I refuse to use. So, to clarify, you're person cutting the new gender neutral bathrooms? Yeah. I mean, what would you prefer? A plaque with your name on it above your own golden private shitter? Is that too much to ask? Yeah. <laughs> if Viv wants to act like cats, let's act like cats. And what do cats do, Tom? Refuse to go places because dogs might be there. Lives, please. Look, I'll let you piss about more than anyone. I'd rather it wasn't literal. Here you are, Linda. Cheeky little car wash. Oh, don't you just hate it when you get splashed back on your tits? Oh. Do you want to come to a funeral tomorrow and watch me fight a dog? Baby, you're calling, calling me.